Hello everybody, it's one happy crafty chick. Ah ha 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 ha! I'm only joking. I've been wanting to do that for weeks. One happy crafty chick is Carol's channel and I just wanted to mix you guys all up and think, oh, I thought I was on Christina's channel. So anyways, yeah, it's me, Christina. And I'm going to do a card share. And this is a challenge that I'm doing. Sybil is having a birthday giveaway challenge. So yesterday I did part one, which, and today I'm going to do a Valentine's card. So part two of her challenge is to do a Valentine's or birthday card. So here's my Valentine's card. It's not finished, so I'm going to do it to get. We're going to do it together. Uh, so my card is. Let's see. Look at that. I, I need a new ruler. I can't even see. I can't even see the measurements on there anymore. And I broke my other ruler t yesterday, so gotta gotta put buy ruler on my list. So this is about five and a half by six. The cardstock I'm using. I got a whole pack of this at Michaels. Or no, at um, Walmart. So it's it's about 65 pound paper. This is the cardstock I'm using. I don't know where I picked this up. I think I got this pack at Winners. It's called Daisy D's. So I am using this paper here and I cut a section of the paper out right here. And then this music paper is from a kit, a Valentine kit that I bought last year off of the Crafty Secrets website. So I've got that in the center. A doily and some really pretty trim at the bottom. The lace I used Glimmer Mist. There's nothing left in the bottle so I just poured a little bit of this color in there with some water and that's what I use to glimmer this up and then I'm using these flowers and I don't know if I got these from Wild Orchid Crafts or I Am Roses but I also misted this flower and just dabbed my finger in the green color and went dab 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 so that's going on the card, uh, seam binding bow. I got this gorgeous bling from a local scrapbooking store here. The last one, so I've got to go buy some more. Isn't that beautiful? And this is going in there, and you know what? This used to have this little, um, I don't know, like a swirly thing on it. And it was, it was meant to go in your hair as decoration. And I had a whole bunch of these in my hair when I got married to Mark. So now, and I've got about, oh, I don't know, six of these. I only have four left. Now they are becoming embellishments. And this is going on my card too. And this was part of the Crafty Secrets Valentine kit. So, and I inked the edges. What else did I do to this card? Oh yeah, everything is inked on here too. Oh, and I stamped the back because I got this as a birthday present from Mona. And I love my little stamp. And that is the inside of my card. And this uh, corner punch was in a Christmas present rack that I got from Monica. And I have a stamp, let's see, here it is, by Autumn Leaves. So I use this one down here, but I didn't use the key. I just used this part of the stamp. So the key to happiness is love. And I just took a silver charm and glued it on with glossy accents. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue all my um, embellies on with a hot glue gun, but I'm going to fast forward everything. We are done. 
I had originally hot glued this, but the backing on this gem is, I don't know, it's like, I don't know what the material is, but it's kind of slippery almost. So the glue, hot glue didn't work. So I had to take it off and I put these uh, three dots, adhesives. They bond really well, so I put that underneath. I put one underneath the little tag. And you know what? I originally was starting to make this for hubby. I thought well, this would be his Valentine's card, but it's a little too girly. It's a little too pink for him. So I'm going to have to get more of those. So there we are. There is my um, my card for the Sybil's Giveaway Challenge. Bye-bye, everybody.